If you've seen all these big content creators, they have these fancy mixers and go XLRs that they can control, you know, Spotify and Discord volume and all of the other device volumes on the go, right? But you can do that in OBS right now with this new update. It's really simple and it takes you no longer than a few clicks. So let me show you how to do that and how you can save a few hundred bucks by simply using it in software and with hotkeys. Let's go. As you can see, I have my OBS open right here. I'm on the newest version, 29.1.3. But if you are on 28 and above, you will be able to use this feature. So how this feature works is you basically add a source and then it controls the audio for a specific device, just like a mixer does just like anything else that you pay a few hundred dollars for. Keep in mind, I do have a GoXLR that I'm using right now, but you can still do this even if you don't have anything and you can do it completely for free. So all you have to do is go to sources, click on add, and then you have this new thing called application audio capture beta. So click on that and then you add a new source. So over here, we can type Spotify, for example, if we want to control Spotify. So over here, we choose what window we want. Obviously, we want Spotify, so we click Spotify and keep everything else as it is. So now over here in the bottom, you can see that Spotify tab has shown up in the volume mixer. So if I play any song on Spotify right now, it's going to show up right over here. Over here, you can actually change the volume of a specific source. So if we want Spotify to be, you know, just like quiet while we're playing uh, games or whatever while we're streaming as you can see the music is playing but if we turn it down or turn it up it will be either quiet or loud so you can do that with any device you want if you have you know discord and you talk to your friends while you play games or anything like that you can go ahead and do the same thing add application audio capture and type discord and then do the same thing for discord i choose discord right here and now another tab in my audio mixer shows up that is called discord and now if we have anything playing in discord we can turn it up or down in the audio mixer so you don't have to have this fancy go xlr or fancy mixers where you control it on the go obviously it will be much easier and simpler but these devices cost you a few hundred dollars and if you're starting out you can't really afford that this is a great solution to fix that kind of stuff what you can even do is go to settings and then go to hotkeys right in the bottom right here scroll down until you find a specific source which is a uh, discord for me for example and then you can enable mute and unmute so for example if you want to quickly mute your music and you don't have a stream deck or anything else you can simply hotkey it to like f5 or f12 or any other bind and then simply click it to mute the song to say something on stream or to you know whatever is happening you can mute and unmute really quickly using these hotkeys in obs I hope this video was helpful. If you got this far into it, make sure to drop a like button. It would mean the world and it takes just a few seconds for you. If you don't already know, I do stream on Twitch three days a week. Link is down in the description below. Make sure to also check my other AI videos and OBS guides that I do on this channel right over here. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out and have a good one. Bye-bye.